We are in Bönan, Gävle, and I'm going to check if we have ice in this sea or if we can paddle. So let's go down. It is minus three degrees, so we have some ice on the dock and also ice on the water but it seems like I can go out through the ice or it seems like a passage out from the ice. I was thinking of a touring fin today but forgot that at home so it will be the Eisbach river fin today. I want the feeling with this wet shoes but it is cold today so it will be the big boats and I hope I don't fall in. I've been stand-up paddling since 2016. Winter paddling is not for everyone. If you are an unexperienced paddler, don't go alone and have someone with you who have the experience of winter paddling. <laughs> and where is the paddle? I need to go back to the car. <laughs> oh. Right now you are watching a weekly paddle vlog or outdoor vlog because sometimes I do something else than paddling but paddle is what I love to do most. I do this vlog to inspire you in your everyday life to go out and do something outdoor. So hit the subscribe button and follow me on this journey. When I was about to enter the water, a man came and asked me if it was a good idea to paddle today. Most Swedes are used to skate on ice, uh, ski on snow, but paddle, that is tough. Uh, so that's not what you do in Sweden. I think 99 point something thinks this is a bad idea to do this in winter. Oh, I really feel start to feel some swell and here I also think we have ice need to check this out yep but it is just like it's ice but no ice at all just when I was going out I saw a pilot boat and I also see a bigger ship coming in but I think we might miss that. I have some bigger ice flakes here. I need to <coughs> take me out from this. <laughs> but it's fun to paddle in ice. Really fun. The ship that um, I saw coming in faster than I thought, so I will go in another direction I think so I'm not in the way of that big ship when it comes in I think that's a good idea Ice come and floats everywhere here. Fika time, drifting with the wind and the swell. We will see if I will be able to say this without start to cry. This morning I got a comment from Janet when I woke up saying that this adventure I do 
inspire her when she sits home and uh, have cancer <coughs> treatment and you know to get a comment like that <laughs> yeah I said that I <clears throat> that inspires me to continue paddle and filming <laughs> and Janet I <clears throat> really hope that you will be cured and healed and Janet she's not the only one who make comments and encourage me and say thank you and I'm so grateful so it's time to paddle back and head the upwind and against the swell but um, I just want to say once more thank you for all your kind comments why don't go up on ice and uh, drift with the ice I don't know where I get everything from but this is fun and uh, now the fun thing will come to back out from this ice There are still minus degrees and it was a cold paddle and the Eisbach river fin was serving me really well with this river fin so it wasn't bad to have that when I go through ice you feel just how it release over the ice that's a really good fin as always thanks for watching see you next week and to then Padda lugnt. In summer it's full of cars here and it's hard to find a parking spot but today I'm the only one here. I wonder why. <laughs>